Hello and welcome to another video. This one is going to be a, a quick update on the Ravel 148 Mosquito that I'm currently building. Um, the build kind of uh, slowed down a little bit over recent um, days and weeks. I, as you know, I um, I built up and started painting my Airfix Harrier and things, so naturally I was buying kits and going, ooh, that's shiny, and building them instead. Um, last night I went back to this, or the last couple of nights. So, since last update, what's happened is I have um, finished the the engine nasals here um, and have buttoned those up. So that's half of those. Um, and the kind of any gaps been filled and, and things. Oops, just watch that. Um, I don't know if you can see it too well in this light, but I've, had, I've got one engine exposed, so the panel will be lying on the ground, so that's been painted up. Um, I may do another little bit of work on that later, but uh, for now it's got some paint on it. It's mainly just black, so. Um, the undercarriage bays are done. The bomb bay's been done for ages. The undercarriage struts have been painted silver and had a black wash, so they look kind of suitably oily and greasy now, which is quite good. Um, I drilled through them, I don't know if you can see that, yeah, you should be able to see there, I drilled through them so the wheels will be held on by bits of wire meaning they can turn because the little st studs almost that um, th that were provided in, uh, on the insides of those to hold the wheels just didn't look particularly secure so uh, so what else, so that's been done, so these are um, the exhaust covers are on there's a small gap here which I might have to fill um, just there uh, nose cones on and been masked. Um, the canopy's on and has been masked with um, liquid mask. Uh, there were so many panels on that that I wasn't wasting my time uh, stretching out Tamiya tape. So hopefully this will do. The um, aerial mast is on. There's still some aerials to go on the end of the wings there. Um, so I'll do them or I might put them on last just because they're quite fragile. There's also a door and a ladder for the crew access to go on, but again, I don't want anything too much sticking off the bottom of it um, while I'm handling it and painting it and things. So, I've just noticed that that nose cone looks slightly squint. That might have to come off because I think that's squint. Anyway, um, yeah, so that's that. So that's ready for primer now. I might do that this evening if I can be bothered. Um, last night I got the props done. Uh, so the nose, the actual cones are matte black uh, from Humbrol. The blades are slightly, although actually I don't think there's much difference, so ultimately they're all black. And the tips were masked off and painted yellow. As you can see, actually, there's a little bit of overspray that's caused some lightning on the bottoms of the blades, so I'm actually going to have to go over that again. But I think I might just get the brush out for that, just because I can't bother getting the airbrush out for two seconds of work. Um, and other bits and pieces, so we've got undercarriage bay doors that's the um, part for the engine um, cover there bomb bay doors and the the wheels have been done as well so I just need to neaten up some bits when I was painting the silver there and that's that so as I said it's just a quick update that's where I am with that um, no other models have progressed since since the Harrier it's got a gloss coat on it now so it's waiting for an oil wash I need to pick up some black oil paint because I've only got um, a brown umber oil paint um, which uh, I don't really think will suit very well so when I've got that I can get the panel wash and stuff done on that um, paint in some details and get the get the, the, the transfers and decals and stuff put on, on that although being a modern fighter jet it's going to have stupid amounts of stencils anyway that'll do for this, thank you for watching um, I'm almost at 100 subscribers I noticed, which is really cool, so I've got, I've got 99. Um, I toyed with the idea of doing something, you know, to celebrate 100 subscribers, but chances are I won't think of anything or I won't have the time and therefore nothing will happen, but yay me. So until the next one, which will be hopefully another update on either this or, or something else. Until then, thanks very much for watching, and um, if you're enjoying these and you're new to this, please do do subscribe, hit the like button, leave a comment. Good to chat to fellow modelers and things. Um, and that'll do for now. It's a nice round five minutes. All right, cheers.